so many. It started out in prep school when I first got in trouble for standing to use the bathroom. I knew I was different when I made the boys football team and had a crush on Renee like all the boys did. It happened again in high school when I fell in love with a girl, but I knew we could never be as I was not the man or boy she would want. The loneliest time of my life was in high school. After high school, I ostracized myself from friends because I didn't want them to feel uncomfortable. Little did I know they loved me and accepted me. Not only was I in love with women, but I was also a yadi with deaf parents. A home where pronouns don't exist. Your name is who you are. But I was still unhappy, as I had to pretend to be someone I was not. After high school, I went to Florida, where I first experienced freedom. I could finally be who I wanted to be. But as life would have it, I ended up back here in Jamaica. My family found out about my love for women, and they no longer supported me. I was all alone. I was considered a failure and a disappointment. I decided I would never change. I decided I would live my truth. I love women, and I will never apologize for it. My career started when I came home to Jamaica, but I still contemplated leaving. It just wasn't conducive to my lifestyle. If I was out, I was referred to as sodomite, amongst other things. I never truly enjoyed public spaces or felt safe. But despite all of this, I choose to stay because of the inequalities in our society. Not only for the LGBTQ plus community, but for the deaf and disabled community. I choose to stay so my deaf family can have access. I choose to stay because Jamaica is my home. I relish in the fact that I am Jamaican. So do me a favor, respect diversity. Just because you're different doesn't mean you don't deserve respect. I want a Jamaica where I can enjoy life with my partner, without derogatory remarks and steer me down contests. I want a Jamaica where I can get married. I want a Jamaica where we love people despite differences. My name is Tony Aiken, I'm a coder, I am a trans man, I'm Jamaican, we are Jamaicans. Just getting by.